Hello and welcome back to the Unboxers and today we have for you a very cool da -da -da -da, Star Wars The Mandalorian 1 7 scale statue part of the premier collection from Diamond Select and General Giant. And he's in Beskar armor. Yes, this is his Beskar armor. He looks really cool. We he want to say a great big thank you to Diamond Select for sending him to us for free to share with you today. So he is part of their premiere collection, which looks really cool. This is kind of like the full version of like the um, resin busts and right. everything, mm -hmm. right? Now they have it in um, like, you know, the full body. Right. So um, very, very cool. Let's turn it around. Whoa. So a little scene from the movie showing the actual armor. And then it does give you a little bit um, about the, a little bit about... The Mandalorian right there. Yes, and it says it's limited to 3,000 pieces. Wow. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get this Mandalorian Premier Collection statue out of the box and give you a much closer look. We'll be right back. All right, and there's the Mandalorian. Wow, he's in he pose. He looks really cool. <laughs> he does look awesome. All right, and it also comes with this little booklet right here which also shows you some of the other awesome ones that come from Diamond Select. Ta-da! Very cool. Some of the full size and then some of the um, busts and the there's like three-quarter mm -hmm. or um, two-thirds. Very cool. Look at that. Wow. Awesome! Alright, now let's take a closer look at the Mandalorian. He does come with a cool collector card and it's also is your certificate of authenticity yes 106 out of 3000 that's amazing very cool all right and as you were showing me the special feature to this one yeah he actually um comes in a couple of pieces like the arm um for storage the arm is actually magnetic and there's like a magnet yeah, so there so it can come his hand or the gun doesn't break off kind of stays there so that way yeah and then he's also pegged into he's actually separate from the yeah you don't have to show the show but anyway, yeah. he's, he's got two pegs in his foot that go down into holes into the base so it kind of comes apart to for easier storage all right so let's go ahead and show him off i'm going to put my hand under the base <clears> to make sure we have him attached i wanted you to see the base it looks like like a sandy stone um type you know um terrain kind of looks like stone it's a little bit of sand and grit it's kind of cool. Got some rocks in there as well. Got some over here, a little bit bigger rocks. But uh, they did a great job creating that yeah. that look. Um, and now let's take a look at him. Mm, yeah, these always very look carefully. really cool. So I wanted you to see. There you go. There's his helmet, and looks really cool. He's got um, some extra ammunition here. The belt going around. Um, his leg is stretched out with some extra ammo there as well. He's got a holster here, which is really cool. We got this leg with um, some armor here as well, and it goes all the way around. Um, his boots look uh, dirt like that's cool. Yeah. How um, like you know you can tell they're it not looks just. Looks like it's got dust on like right sandy dust on them. Yeah, because everything seems to be super dusty in the Star yeah. Wars movies. Even like if you look like in the edge and the of inside the... of his cape. Cape. There's some yeah, that's really neat. Where it's picked up some dust. Definitely <laughs> makes it look very authentic. And on the back of the cape as well. And then it is swooshed around with a little bit of styrofoam. <laughs> styrofoam. Um, his cape is swooshed around on the back right there. But it is hard. So it's a hard piece. Um, it is sculpted like that. I'm going to raise this up and I want to show off the back of his helmet. That's pretty cool. I'll lower him down a little bit. And then um, I'll show his blaster a little bit like this so you can see. There you go. So his hand is sculpted around it, but like John showed, this piece magnetized to it. And I think that's a cool feature um, to if you're moving it around so that it does not get broken off. Yeah. Because that would be a shame. We wouldn't want that to happen. Yeah, and this is, <clears throat> this is really a cool sculpt and it just um, a really awesome piece for 
from the Mandalorian collection. And um, we have previously done some Grogu's. Mm -hmm. So um, it's really cool to add a Mandalorian to our collection. Yes. And stay tuned. We do have another Grogu coming. Oh, yeah. So he's going to look great on the shelf right next to his buddy. Yes. So we want to say another great big thank you to... Diamond Select. For sending him to us for free to share with you today. Thanks so much for watching. As always, come back and see us. Like, subscribe, and we will see you next time. <laughs>